Hello everyone. I hope you are all doing well. I'm Manhar and welcome back to MSFT webcast. In this video, we will guide you step by step on how to install Arch Linux on Windows subsystem for Linux. WSL is a feature in Windows 10 and 11 that allows you to install and run Linux distributions natively without requiring a dual boot up setup or a virtual machine. Think of it as a translator between Windows and Linux, enabling you to use Linux tools, run scripts and even launch GUI apps all without leaving your Windows desktop. While popular distributions like Ubuntu, Debian and Fedora have been available on WSL for a while, we can now officially install and use Arch Linux as well. Arch Linux is renowned for its basic design, rolling release model and user-centric concept. Running it inside WSL on Windows gives us the best of both worlds, a minimal bleeding edge Linux distro alongside a Windows tools. This video provides a step-by-step -step guide on how to install Arch Linux on WSL 2. Before proceeding, make sure WSL is installed and properly configured. You will also need to verify that WSL 2 is being used as version 1 is not supported. If your system meets the prerequisites, follow the steps for installing Arch Linux in WSL and setting it up. Right click on Start menu and select Terminal Admin to launch Windows PowerShell with administrative permissions. First, we are going to check if WSL is up to date or not. Type the command WSL hyphen hyphen update and press enter. From the output, we can confirm that the most recent version of WSL is installed on this Windows 11 system. Type the command WSL hyphen hyphen list and press enter to see the list of Linux distributions installed on this Windows 11 system. We already have Ubuntu installed on this Windows 11 system. Let's see the list of available WSL distributions using the command WSL hyphen hyphen list hyphen hyphen online. Press enter to run the command. As we can see, the Arch Linux image is available. Now to install Arch Linux, use the WSL command WSL hyphen hyphen install Arch Linux. Press enter key to run the command. This will download the official Arch Linux image and install the distribution in our WSL environment. The download and installation process may take some time. Please wait until it completes. Once the installation is finished, you will be logged in as the root. We can launch our Arch Linux with command WSL-D Arch Linux. Since we haven't set a root password yet, let's set it up now. Type the command passwd and press enter. Type and hit up the password to make the change effect. Please note that nothing is displayed on the screen when you type the password. That's normal behavior. When we first launch the Arch Linux WSL instance, we need to update our package list and upgrade all installed packages with this to their newest versions. Type the command pacman-syu and press enter. Type Y and press Enter key to proceed with installation. Once the system is up to date, you can now proceed to install additional software and customize your environment using Pacman. It is not recommended to log in as the root all the time. You need a regular user who can run administrative commands when needed. We can use the user add command to create a new user account in Arch Linux. That's all for this video on how to install Arch Linux on Windows 11 using Windows Subsystem for Linux. I hope you found this video helpful and informative. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos on Windows 11 and other Microsoft related topics. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.